To help you be faster when you create a document, it's good to know the shortcuts. What shortcuts are is a combination of keys that you press and allows you to do a, an operation. So for instance, if I want to um, copy the word shortcuts, I would normally highlight it, then click on edit or right click and then I get this menu and then I would select copy. Then I would move my cursor where I want it and then go again edit and then paste. That takes a bit of time. Uh, to do it faster, what you do is you just highlight the word and then press control key, move your cursor and then control V. So you don't have to go through the extra step or clicking on the menu. And of course this works too with the uh, cut command. If you want to move something instead of copying it, so you go control X, cuts it out and then control V and copies it somewhere else. You can also undo and redo. For instance, if I, let's say, put this in yellow and all of a sudden decide I don't want it, all I do is press control Z and it's gone. If I decide to put it back, all I have to do is control Y and there you go, back it is. You can also undo for more than one operation. For instance, I, if I want to go back to where this was, I only have to press Control Z a bunch of times, and then I go back a few operations. Here's my favorite shortcut. Uh, let's say you post, uh, you copy and paste the link from the internet. It will show up like this on your document. It'll be underlined. It will be blue. Sometimes it's in a different format. So if I wanted to put that the same format as my original text, I would have to do many operations. But with Control M, all I have to do is highlight it, go Control M, and it brings it back to the default format, which is Time News Roman uh, font size 12. And another useful one is the zoom command, um, which you achieve by pressing Control and the scroll, which is the wheel on your mouse. So if you press Control and just turn the wheel up or down, it allows you to zoom out or zoom into your document. And finally, finally, the most important of them all is a Control S command, which allows you to save your document in just one second. So it will take you a little bit of practice at first, but down the road, these shortcuts will save you a lot of time. So go ahead and practice and make sure to save your document regularly.